close your eyes and place your attention on your breath. Breathe in and out. Just put your attention on the breath coming into your body as you inhale. It's clear. Nothing. Have you ever had the feeling that your mind is on a journey, a voyage of discovery? That sometimes it has to make long passages on dark, uncharted seas? The greatest journey is the journey of the mind, since this is what determines the journey of life. A man cannot directly choose his circumstances, but he can choose his thoughts and so indirectly, yet surely, shape his circumstances. You will be what you will to be. Still fine. What? What kind of question is that? You changed. You stopped being you. You let people stick a finger in your face and tell you you're no good. And when things got hard, you started looking for something to blame. Like a big shadow. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You, me, or nobody is gonna hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, now go out and get what you're worth. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you wanna be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that. You just love to wallow in your own ridiculous suffering. yourself enough already for not being perfect? The hours of guilt through every day I need you to know we'll never go away It was through my fear that I pushed forward to meet my ultimate potential. I understood my power, and in the larger scheme, I knew the part I had to play. I was weak in that I lacked the courage to accept responsibility for my unhappiness. Blaming the world is the coward's way out. 
It was ultimately my inner strength that enabled me to break free of the chain. You don't get in life what you want, you get in life what you are. Once you open your mouth, you tell the world who you are. A noble character is not a thing of favor or chance, but is the natural result of continued effort and thought, the effect of long-cherished association with high ideals. They fear us. They fear us because they know our reputation, that we never give up, and we never can. As a being of power, intelligence, and love, and the lord of his own thoughts, man holds the key to every situation and contains within himself that transforming and regenerative agency by which he may make himself what he wills. Man is always the master, even in his weakest and most abandoned state. Self-control is strength. Thought is mastery. Calmness is power. When he begins to reflect upon his condition and to search diligently for the law upon which his being is established, he then becomes the wise master, directing his energies with intelligence and fashioning his thoughts to fruitful issues. Such is the conscious master, and man can only thus become by discovering within himself the laws of thought. Only by much searching and mining are gold and diamonds obtained and man can find every truth connected with his being if he will dig deep into the mine of his soul. This is it, but I need some help. I can't do this alone. Mental suffering is always the effect of error in some direction. It is an indication that the individual is out of harmony with himself, with the law of his being. The sole and supreme use of such suffering is to correct and teach. Mental suffering ceases for him who is wise. What then is the meaning of fighting against circumstances? It means that a man is continually revolting against an effect without, while all the time he is nourishing and preserving its cause in his heart. anxious to improve their circumstances but are unwilling to improve themselves. They therefore remain bound. The man who does not shrink from self-sacrifice can never fail to accomplish the object upon which his heart is set. Act is the blossom of thought and joy and suffering are its fruits. As a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. A man is literally what he thinks, his character being the complete sum of all his thoughts. Man is made or unmade by himself. In the armory of thought he forges the weapons by which he destroys himself. He also fashions the tools with which he builds for himself heavenly mansions of joy and strength and peace. By the right choice and true application of thought, man ascends toward divine perfection. By the abuse and wrong application of thought, he descends below the level of the beast. There is some unfinished business I have to attend to. In this final battle, there will be no boundaries. Is that all you got for me? As an evolving being, man is where he is that he may learn, that he may grow. And as he learns the lesson which any circumstance contains for him, 
it passes away and gives place to other circumstances.
I have no idea what fate has in store for you, but you must remain open to any possibility. Mind is the master power that molds and makes. And man is mind. And evermore he takes the tool of thought and shaping what he wills, brings forth a thousand joys, a thousand ills. He thinks in secret, and it comes to pass environment is but his looking glass. A man only begins to be a man when he ceases to whine and revile and commences to search for the hidden justice which regulates his life. And as he adapts his mind to that regulating factor, he ceases to accuse others as the cause of his condition and builds himself up in strong and noble thoughts, ceases to kick against circumstances, but begins to use them as aids to his more rapid progress and as a means of discovering the hidden powers and possibilities within himself. Law, not confusion, is the dominating principle in the universe. Feeling sorry for yourself isn't going to make things grow again. It's going to take a lot of hard work. I think that got the point across. <laughs>